Since I didn't review episode 3 or last week's episode of Parasite, I will be reviewing this week's and last week's episode. It's going to be a dual episode review, episode 3 and 4 of Parasite. Oh my god, the greatness. Yo, I love this show so much. Just everything about the show, just the characters, the feeling, you know, the fact that it's also horror. You also get the feeling that something horrible is going to happen. Like, you know, how I got this feeling, like how... Shinji's parents in episode 4 basically end up going on a vacation and at the end of that game when they left the door I thought they were gonna die or something you know my heart had literally had a fucking attack on it It was just at home I was just so scared and I have a feeling that something really horrible is gonna happen to his parents that's gonna change him and make him the way he is like <clears throat> He's gonna change his character majorly because I think that you know a major death like that could change him. So basically, in the third episode, we got introduced to basically Tamio, basically a like woman who is apparently a parasite, but her host apparently you know her host is really strong, whatever. And also you know the parasite was after having her as well, you know she's able to train that you know factor like you know she can stay like you know how she is. She's really strong. She can control herself, but a Tan or a San whatever is also opposite. She cannot he cannot control himself. He has he thinks humans are inferior creatures which is you know are useless and to be eaten only just like how we humans eat chicken and everything else like beef whatever you know we just are there to eat a prudent way to eat a way to like you know we fulfilled our needs whatever of hunger whatever else so after a little while after they met obviously you know they said they had to talk with Sheen Shiver in a cafe whatever talking everything else and ate a sign basically left because he was really angered by it then after he went and attacked the school, I was like, hey, son, such a fucking idiot. Why do you have to do that, man? Like, why do you have to go attack an entire school? Oh, I, just, I hate it, hey, son, man. I'm so glad that in the episode 4 that he died. Because Teo basically stopped him because he was going to die by Shinchi. Basically, Shinchi and um, Migi had a plan. They had a plan to execute the plan properly. They did it. You know, basically, Shinchi stabbed him with, like, you know, apparently the table leg, which Migi made into a blade. Stabbed him. He was gonna. Oh, he was gonna actually share freaking Tayo's host, but obviously she knew that would probably happen. So you know, obviously he wanted to switch hosts with her. You know, overtake the host completely. She decided to kill him. Obviously, some oxygen, like you know, fire, whatever, or something like that, exploded and Asa and died. Afterwards, obviously Tayo's host basically. Uh, Tayo's basically gone. Her host, you know, of the freaking parasite overtook Tayo or Reiko overtook the host and obviously you know like you know i have no use for anyone around it was going to kill everybody you know obviously with the whole factor also since a son and her had sexual intercourse to find out you know what happened if a parasite had son you know like two parasites to have a baby the baby would actually turn to be human we discovered that in episode three and like how her baby is actually starting to move is trying to be born more so obviously you know she said you know might do experiments on the baby just to be curious and she and she's got mad as fuck he wanted to kill her because obviously you know what's gonna happen is she gonna kill everyone he loves is she is he gonna kill her is what's just gonna happen all these questions and answers that will eventually happen towards the next few episodes because i'm just really interested in this show sorry if i sound like i'm going back and forth to different points it's just overall i really do love this show a lot and i'm so so glad it's 24 episodes because sometimes I think the show is 12 episodes and I get sad but I realize that you know double that and I get a lot happy because the show won't be right this show will be I basically I think it's gonna be a uh, what's it called a fall leftover in spring maybe I think the show might wrap up around in spring or end of winterish because I just cannot <clears throat> my apologies for the voice crack why I have not talked a lot today so Basically, I cannot wait for episode 6 of Parasite. Be sure let me know if you guys are ready. I just want to know what Teo's going to do. The fact that her baby's moving. Like, you know, she obviously going to... If she's ever going to have the baby, what's going to happen? She's going to care for the human. She's probably not. She's going to eat the human baby, whatever. Is it a boy or a girl? Maybe my curiosity. Whenever a child is born, I always wonder if it's a boy or a girl. I hope it's a boy because boys are... I don't know. I just, I, it's just random thought. Food for thought, I suppose. So overall, a son's a fucking idiot, dude. I just want to know how Shinji's going to change. Is Shinji's parents going to die or not? Is Shinji going to be alright? He's going to find out the news, what's going to happen. We saw all these different parasites in the opening. I don't know if we're going to meet them throughout the show and everything else. A new parasite is going to start popping up around. He's going to stop them because we so far we see Migi's really smart and powerful. Ever since Migi also figured out to disconnect himself from Shinji, apparently spectate him, see him. So if he's in trouble, he can always see him. <clears throat> wow, I have a lot. I really need to drink some water. I have this. Good Lord. So basically overall, that's what happened in the first three, third or fourth episode. I will be reviewing Parasite normally now when it comes out on Wednesdays. I'll definitely be reviewing like one episode each. My name is Pazman PG, and I'll see you guys later. Farewell.